Hello guys, welcome back to Game of Bulk Reviews! Today we're here to review the three new X Gamer Any Pouches flavors. Let's get it! First off, Energy Drink. Let's start by looking at the design. So they got a blue, red and white, very American type of uh, color pattern here. But it's actually supposed to look a bit like a Red Bull. Hint, hint, uh, but it's not actually Red Bull. So yeah, they used uh, their colors at the least. Supposedly it's supposed to taste like a Red Bull, uh, or more like the, re the standard Red Bull uh, and you drink flavor that we're all used to at this point. Maybe you can't see it on camera, but uh, it's actually a bit of a glittery type of pattern on the bolt here, so to say. So it looks pretty nice in the right light. So yeah, looks clean, I like it. I've had some comments asking how I open these ones. It can be quite hard to explain, but basically you just put your nails into a little slit here where there is a small black uh, thin line and then you just rip it open like this and then the plastic removes as well and then you can just put it back on and remove it easily. The lid on the top here is not uh, where you open the container. Here you put used pouches if you don't have a um, garbage bin or a garbage can close to you so you can uh, dispose of them at a later date because you shouldn't litter. Ooh, these smell nice and they also have a quite brownish color to it, a brown red almost. Now let's go for the taste. And yeah, one pouch contains 50 milligrams of caffeine. That's all there is to it actually. And how you insert it is you just do like that. Put it in uh, under your top lip. You can put it on either side, it doesn't really matter. And you let the caffeine absorb through your gums. Does it hurt? Uh, if you're new to it, it might sting just a little bit because your gums are not used to absorbing content through them but you will get used to it very quickly in my opinion. Uh, I would say the initial caffeine surge from these pouches is much much heavier than you get from a any drink. I mean I inserted it like less than one minute ago and I'm already feeling pretty hyped up. When we say taste with these ones it's a very very mild taste. The, the flavor is so vague that you barely feel it. So the flavor only lasts for like the first two minutes. But overall you won't really feel a strong flavor unless you put your tongue on it sometimes. Uh, which I do from time to time just to put it, make sure it's in place. The flavor dissipates very quickly. I also get the question how long should I have a pouch in my mouth for? And uh, it really depends. Uh, I would say when you stop feeling a caffeine surge from it, you should just remove it. Or when it's gotten a bit too dry, you should remove it. Yeah, I wouldn't say like longer than 20 minutes, 30 minutes at most. So to summarize, I would say that it's a very vague uh, any drink flavor. It smells more than it tastes. Would I say that this tastes like an any drink? Sure. If you enjoy an any drink flavor, uh, I would probably go for these ones, 100%. Just like that, put it in here, lock it, boom. Then you can dispose of the used pouches later on if you don't have a garbage bin or garbage chute close to you. Overall, I would say the flavor is very, very good for what it is. It had a vague uh, form of any drink flavor to it and I quite liked it. It smelled very good and uh, yeah, I liked the design of it. Very nice. Up next. Tarocco Apple. Let's start with the design of this one. So this one is supposed to uh, be a tribute to a very popular uh, soda here in Sweden or Scandinavia, I'm unsure there, called Trocadero. Obviously they couldn't use the Trocadero name so they went for something that sounds similar which is Tarocco. And supposedly Trocadero is supposed to taste like apple, that's why they call it Tarocco Apple. Uh, Trocadero also has this, this color scheme as well, uh, the blue and uh, yellow, green and red. But overall just a nice, clean, simple design. Nothing much to say about it. On to the taste test. Boom! These are just white, 
so it's a very boring color overall, but it looks clean at least. Just, just grab one here. This feels moist. Uh, also, uh, I've gotten comments about how to that some pouches are dry after a while. Uh, one thing you can do to keep them a bit more moist so it doesn't hurt your gums is just to have a spray bottle with water uh, with a, the mist setting on and just uh, spray them a bit. Not a, not a lot, but just a bit so they get a bit more moist and then you can shake it up or something and then you can use them. Let's insert. Put in the right side this time. Mm. With these pouches, the initial uh, insertion is going to have the most taste, uh, which quickly dissipates after a short while. There's a certain apple flavor here, and I've had Trocadero, but, but it's been a while, and uh, I would say that it's pretty close in taste. So yeah, just imagine a apple soda almost. It's mostly taste of apple though, not sour apple, just regular apple. But yeah, it's quite sweet, and it has a clean and crisp apple flavor to it. Pretty close, I would say, to the flavor of Trocadero, which is kind of weird, considering it's an energy pouch. It's not something you would expect from an energy pouch, or snooze in this case. I quite enjoyed it, so yeah, off to the next one. Last but not least, cotton candy. Design-wise, I like the cyan with the pink here. As most of us know, uh, when you go to carnivals or amusement parks and they sell cotton candy, you usually get them with a blue in a blue color or a pink color. So this fits perfectly. So overall, a very nice and uh, sort of nostalgic color scheme to this one, and I quite enjoy it. Time to taste it. I don't have any nails, so this sort of hurts. There we go. Woo! That's a very sweet. That's very weird coming from an any pouch, but I like it. Uh, yeah, they're just mostly white, so nothing to expect here. Uh, enough talk, let's put this in again. I have a very small upper lip, so it's sometimes hard for me to put one in there. But yeah, wow. Uh, very sweet, almost sugary taste to it. Uh, I know there's a sort of difference between blue cotton candy and pink cotton candy. But this just gonna taste like just pure sugary cotton candy. It's very weird, but uh, I quite like it actually. If you're a fan of cotton candy and very sweet, sugary type of flavors, you would probably enjoy this one a lot. It's uh, weirdly authentic, I gotta say. As of now, it has lasted a bit longer than the other flavors as well. Yeah, this one was very good. I quite enjoy it. So, that was all of the new X Gamer Any Pouch flavors as of now. Yeah, I liked all of these three actually. I wasn't disappointed in uh, one of them. Now, if I would have to rate them, in my opinion, I would probably say, sadly, in my opinion, uh, any drink uh, had the weakest taste out of the three. It dissipated the quickest. And I would say cotton candy had the strongest taste. However, I preferred the taste of Taroko apple the most, so I would probably put from best to worst uh, like this. So Taroko apple first, corn candy second, and any drink in third place. So yeah, if you want to try these new flavors, you can get them yourself with the link in the description. They exist as a one pack or a ten pack. That's my review on X Gamer Any Pouches, Taroko apple, corn candy, and any drink. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification button to get notified whenever I upload a new video. And yeah guys, it's been fun. Gamer Bulk, out. <laughs>